Well, welcome back to Great Day Washington. Our favorite Soka sister is back to tell us where and when we can get in on the fun, the feathers, and the dancing of her DC class. Please welcome back Shamika Farquhar, also known as the Soka Nista, founder of the Soka Tribe. Welcome. Looking beautiful as always. <laughs> Thank you guys, and thanks so much for having us back. Want to reintroduce our Soka Tribe chief, Giselle Hunt. Hi, hey. Giselle. Hello. Now, we're so excited to have you back on the show. I think you're a Great Day All-Star because you've done like three or four appearances. We love it. We, we love it too. And since we saw you last, you were at the Kennedy Center? Yes, it was awesome. So we were at the Kennedy Center on the Millennium Stage in May, early, at the beginning of the month, doing a Funk Power dance preview because we were a part of the DC Funk Parade. So it's actually the oldest street festival, one of the oldest street festivals here in DC for uh, grassroots artists. So we're really excited to be a part of that and bring it to the Kennedy Center. And we were able to literally I always tell people, we took people through a carnival journey. We did some historic stuff, which I'm going to show you later today. Oh. And uh, then we brought in some fancy sailors, which is really deep into the, the culture. And then we took it to our Feather and Fun. Yeah. We had to end it with <laughs> Carnival on the Road. Um, so just, it was, it was, I mean, I'm not at a loss for words. I'm still like, <laughs> you were at the Kennedy Center. I was at the yeah. Kennedy Center. <laughs> the tribe was at the Kennedy Center. Like, we had, uh, so we'll do it now. When I say Soka Tribe, you say, way. Soka Tribe, way. way the whole <laughs> Kennedy Center hallway. I was on stage like, I have a line. Remember your line. There's a line that comes next, so. Remind our viewers what Soka Tribe is all about. Definitely, Soka Tribe is a community on a mission to spread the vibe of Carnival, which is love, freedom, and expression. We do that through our fitness classes. We have the Soka Tribe Convoy, the performing group, was at the Kennedy Center. And we also do educational programming and experiences. So we do private events and things of that sort. Well, I was first introduced to the Soka Nista as a birthday gift, my friend Nicole, said, we're going to take a dance class. And I said, what? I want to go out and eat for my birthday. She said, no, you're going to work out. And I sweated out. my hair out. I mean, I never worked so hard in my life. But it was such a great class. Tell me about some of your events coming up in June. Definitely. So we have our traditional Soka Tribe DC class. Mm -hmm. It'll be on Saturday uh, the 9th, as well as all of the following Thursdays in June uh, at Off-Road DC, 905 U Street. Uh, we also have some special events uh, added on to that. We are doing an event on June 10th called Solar Sunday. Um, we also, there will be, and this is the, the most exciting part, so I'm going to put these feathers on you guys okay. because Ooh. at the end of June, okay. I always like this we part. are all prepping to oh, go help. on the road <laughs> at, get oh, this, right. it's a party called Rhythm and Road. Rhythm but, and Road. But they have turned this venue, they're, so it's, we're actually going to be outside, they're going to be a music truck, we're going to wear our costumes, and we're going to be like Carnival almost in D.C. Nice. I like so, this. We're all, the tribe is going to be you there. You are great. Um, I love when you bring the feathers. <laughs> <laughs> can, I, can I just warn all of my Soka sisters out there, if you're going to go to one of her classes, don't get your hair done the day before, OK? It is not, it is not a hair you, done situation. You're going to sweat with the wine, right? The wine down. Yes, the whining, yes. the whining, the whining. <laughs> so I understand you have a performance today. Tell us yes. about that and what you're going to do. So we're going to dance to a song called Magic. Okay. Mm. Um, so all the things we're going to do today kind of like focus on our womenness and our magic. Uh, we're going to dance first to magic and then I want to show you some traditional ballet moves to a new song called Aya, which is also about how amazing the woman is. So. All right. Here Beautiful. we go. We'll take this away. Thanks. And take it away. <laughs>
Come give me.